what's going on, y'all? So, uh, y'all already know who it is. It's your boy, Cameron McCup, a.k.a. Yeah. Master Teacher of Attraction, right? And, you know, we're going to do the same thing we tried to do the last time we went to the casino. Um, try to do it with 200 this time because I know the machines a lot better. Um, I'm going to go to the aisle. The aisle Capri or whatever that one was. I went to another one. I didn't really hit at that one because it was so many um, machines. And it was it was kind of smart from a business perspective how they had it set up. But people, people was winning in there. It's just so many machines. And, you know, I'm not, just like I said, I'm not a pro at this. I don't know the machines like that. It was a high limit room, but you know what I'm saying? Their high limit room was full of stuff that was on the outside. So, um, hey, it's, it's, it's smart from a business perspective, but um, I'm going to go ahead and let me tell y'all something. If y'all eating right, y'all probably not going to need this. Okay. Now, dairy don't usually mess me up if we're talking about cheese. Um, cheese and butter. Like, that shit actually helps. That shit helps me a lot. Because I can run off of them two things for energy from a fat metabolism standpoint. But... You know, when we talking about something processed heavily, like protein powder, even though that's isolate, that isolate has a lot less issues than the whey concentrate. But I'm telling you, man, my gosh. Ever since I've been taking either one of those, man, my digestive system has been feeling like it literally has had a log in there. You know what I'm saying? I don't, I don't, I'm not used to feeling that way. You know what I'm saying? Cheese don't constipate me. Butter don't constipate me. You know what I'm saying? If it, anything, it lubricates my system. So everything can, you know, keep going. And that's why I use those two things. And I don't fuck with milk and shit like that. But, um, that pro, them protein powders, you guys, look, man, ain't nothing better than this. Y'all know what that is? Y'all know what that is? Alright. Actually, she cooked that shit. Um, ain't nothing better than them things, man. That When I be saying nutrition, that's what I mean. Nutrition. Yeah, I gotta let y'all get some of them views out here in Missouri. All them cows and shit out here. The vegans gonna hate this shit. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's no factories. This is one of the things I was saying about Missouri. One of the first things that I moved. Because y'all gotta keep in mind. Uh, I'm from Chicago, Illinois. And, you know, every so often you may come across some, some cows on the pasture. You understand? But I mean, out here... You see, 10 minutes within driving on one of the expressways, man, cows. As soon as I hit into the border, uh, shit, cows. You know what I'm saying? And I don't be seeing these cows on, uh, you know, all on these uh, factory machine type deals. You know what I'm saying? Like, a place like this, you can easily find, like, a butcher. You can go to the farmer market. And they just get the cows from right here. Same with the eggs, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm noticing that the eggs are more yellow out here. You know what I'm saying? Because I like to get my eggs from Aldi. And like their regular eggs have more yellow compared to a place like Walmart. But that's just something I wanted to share with y'all.
Alright y'all, just came out the casino. Y'all see where we at. You know what I'm saying? Came to the same spot, you know, to, since it's producing, you know, keep milking it, you know what I'm saying? So I went went there, went in there with my 200, came out with almost 500, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm telling you, literally, I know the machines, and I know what's going on. Thanks to, you know, Jeremy let me know through his course. Um, and now that I know it, I can teach it to people down in my course, too. Um, but, yeah, this stuff is is working. Uh, I got my little spot. You know, I just came out of there. Went in there for only, like, 20 minutes. Literally. Put in my 100. Bam. With the first two hits, he hit that max bet. You know what I'm saying? Boom. I was literally, it was one point where I was winning 100. I put that 100 back in. They gave me another 100. I put that 100 back in. And then, because uh, I was doing 25s. And uh, and this is on slot machines. Uh, I was doing 25. And, uh, you know, once it, once it went to two in a row where it didn't give me 100, I just said, let me go ahead and just keep what I got. <laughs> Yeah, man. I didn't even invest. I, you know, I just kept reinvesting. Hold on. I just kept reinvesting the winnings. You know what I'm saying? And once they, it went two in a row, I'm like, okay, I'm done, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, we still got self-control with it. It ain't like motherfuckers got gambling issues, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. At them certain machines, you know, they giving their money away. You know what I'm saying? So literally, you put in a bill, then it give you more. <laughs> you put in a bill, it give you more. And I'm just, you know, I'm just going to use it for creating a uh, business. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, man, I just wanted to show y'all that little tidbit. I'm going to have this information, of course, for people who don't know or understand what's why why the casinos are doing this. You know what I'm saying? Um... Yeah, man. I mean, it's that simple. It's that simple. Uh, y'all, y'all know. Just like I said in the other video, I'm not, I'm not uh, someone who goes to the casino and does a lot of gambling like that. You know what I'm saying? This, this is my third time going, and uh, this has happened. You know, two out of the three times. Okay. The other, the other one, I didn't hit. I didn't go to. Uh, that casino was the Indigo Sky Casino. Um, it was so many machines, the way, the way they had it set up, you know what I'm saying? I wasn't doing max bet either. I don't know if that's something with it. Um, but yeah, there's a little button on the machines called max bet. I was just hitting that motherfucker right there. And, you know, it was, it kept giving me money. You know what I'm saying? So, um, y'all can tell, I don't know too much about this stuff, but I just go in, came in with 200 this time. And came out flipping my money. You know what I'm saying? So, that's cool. Be back next week. Um, just wanted to show y'all this little bit of footage, y'all. Uh, I'm going to have it down in the course below. Hey, check it out, man. Peace.